Anthony L. Elmore, president and founder of the Proud Black Women's World Association, here today to bring you in another exciting Black Buddhist Lectures. We at the Proud Black Buddhist World Association are not only the Black Buddhist Voice in America, we are the Black Buddhist Voice in the world, and we are the only Black Buddhist organization in the world that do not have Asian Buddhist masters. When we learn that the Asians educated all Black history, culture, and language from the Buddhist teachings, we educated them out as our teachers. Now, today we're going to bring an exciting Buddhist lecture. My lecture today is the Nation of Islam Connection to the Hindu Brahman Teachings. It was the Hindu Brahman Teachings that destroyed the Black Buddhist Teachings. And our brothers in the Nation of Islam have a connection to the strong or the teachings that destroyed the black Buddhist teachings. To Dr. Dr. Wesley Muhammad in his books, The Religion of the Black God and the Book of God, British historian Sir Godfrey Higgins point out in his 1836 book, The Anaclipsis, that the Temple of Mecca was founded by a colony of Brahmins from India. They point out the time and the date when Mecca was founded. Dr. Wesley Muhammad saw Mecca as a place of gods, whereas in reality, Mecca was founded by Brahmins from India. The father of the Brahman is Brahma or Abraham. This is what you must understand about Dr. Wesley Muhammad and the Nation of Islam. You see, the scholar, scientist, historian, and author of languages, Sir Godfrey Higgins' teachings is based on archaeology, anthropology, genetic science, literary science, and linguistic science. Dr. Wesley Muhammad cannot present any archaeology, anthropology, genetic science, literary science, and linguistic science to prove that Mecca is the root of civilization. In fact, the teachings of Abraham come from Brahma. There is no archaeological, anthropological, genetic science, literary science, or linguistic science to even prove the existence of Abraham. The story of Abraham come from the story of the Hindu Vedas. So when you see Abraham and you see Noah and you see Moses, all of these teachings come from the Hindu Vedas and they are false teachings without any sign. The word Abraham is derived from the Sanskrit word Brahma. The root of Brahma is Bra, which means to grow or multiply in number. In addition, Lord Brahma, the creator God of Hinduism is said to be the father of all men and exalted of all gods, for it is from him that all beings were generated. Thus again, we come to the meaning of exalted father. This is a clear pointer that Abraham is none other than the heavenly father Brahma. The temple of Mecca was founded by a colony of Brahmins from India. It was a sacred place before the time of Muhammad and they were permitted to take pilgrimage to it from several centuries after his time. Its great celebrity as a sacred place long before the time of the prophet cannot be doubted. Tell me what the line I see, disregard what the facts may be. Tell me what's the line Show a simple fact. They all showed that the Buddha was black. I believe in facts and the Kato was wrong. Buddha was no Aryan. This song saw the history. But those who rewrite history, run that so that there's something to understand. It was a thousand years after Buddha's death, his teacher ride in Japan. Let me tell you something that makes sense. The Buddha's teachings did 
the star and the orient. Those of you make a religious decision, the Buddha's teaching no ancient religion. The Buddha's religion has a lot of mystery. Ancient took out all the black Buddhist history. Let me lay on you the history and the facts. Look at the ancient Buddhist statues, he's always right. Let me lay this on you all the black Buddhist history and take out all the Buddhist mystery. The land today they call India. In the old days, it was called Eastern Ethiopia. The first people in the land were called Dravidian. The same people today were called Nubian. It is the land where we find the birth of racism. It all started in a religion called Brahmanism. The f- one is called the Vedic culture. The culture was a religion called Hinduism. They created the world's first religious racism. They created systems called caste that made black people eternally last.